Meanwhile, I'm vibing with Ken. Bro, you are not fine. Children. <laughs> hey guys, it is Bible Ken here back at again with another YouTube video for y'all. If you're new to my channel, my name is Kendall from Wisconsin. I'm 18 and I'm fruity. I'm fruity. Yeah. And if you're new to my channel, turn post notifications on and subscribe because it's like, if you're not. What are you doing? Are you a weirdo? Don't be weird. Don't be weird. Come on. Hit the subscribe button. So today, we're going to be going downtown to a little coffee shop called Abrazo Coffee. And then we're going to get in our industrial pierce today. So today, I don't know if I want to put this like in a separate vlog or two in one. Because tomorrow... No, what am I off? I'm off on Monday or Tuesday. One of the days. I think I want to go like get me some body scrubs and buy me some new deodorant and stuff like that. Like all those essentials and stuff. <sighs> Let me stop talking. Y'all all gonna see what's gonna happen, but I'm gonna pick the camera back up when I'm in the coffee shop. Oh, and another thing today, I look good. I look fine, so it's like, at the end of the day, leave a like and subscribe because I look good. And y'all, don't come at me. Don't come at me, y'all. But I'm back with the wires today because I gotta order some new AirPods because, bro, I bought them refurbished, right? From this website called The Back Market or whatever. And you know, I got a phone from there before. It was all good, it was all Gucci, you know, working like Apple, but, my right AirPod Pro went out. And I, I paid for the condition to be excellent, like brand new practically. So it's just like, why are you cutting out next to ghetto? So I sent them back and got a refund, but I guess the place is in Texas, right? So it's like, I don't know, it's like a business. So they were unable to deliver it the first day cause like they were closed or something. So I gotta wait for them to re-deliver on the next business day. So I'll get my money back. So hopefully I get my money back like maybe this week, next, maybe sometime next week, like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, one of this week, because like that was $150 I paid for y'all. For one AirPod to work, it was all Gucci for a good two weeks. All good Gucci for a good two weeks. It was working just fine. I can lick it, I can ride it. She was playing, bro. I was sound like I was on the moon, Helen Keller in this bitch. I was outside, I felt like I was deaf. Like, is this what that deaf people we really be feeling like? My dog was barking, I couldn't hear nothing. That man was mute, mute, okay? I was chilling when I was on the bus and I start hearing a static noise in the right ear pod. I'm like, this bitch wanna blow up? Like, what you gonna do? Self-destruct in this mode? Like, come on now, like, are you caring from the chum bucket? It stopped working, it went out on me. So I was like, you know what? It's a return policy I know that's still on there. So I'm gonna send it back to get my money. So. Now I'm on that way for that money to hit my account so they can receive the fucking package. Because I texted them, I was like, hey, I sent the bag, but you know, y'all getting delays and stuff because y'all being closed. But but yeah, that's all I had to tell y'all for now. Y'all, I'm almost downtown. I'm at peace. If you're from Wisconsin and you're from Racine, you should know, you should know. By walking on the street, it's always somebody asking for change, asking you know, for a little liquor, asking you for a little drink, a little, little smoke, smoke, because it was this lady walked past. No homes, no home gang. I felt like she was gonna ask me for some change. So she stood there for a minute when I walked past. I was like, ooh, let me put my AirPods. <laughs> I was gonna say AirPods, I ain't got no AirPods. I got wire, be for real. I thought she was gonna ask me for some money. Cause I be walking fast. I don't know about y'all, but I'm a fast walker. Like I be really be like walking the pace. I be like, regular show skips. How that man be like, <laughs> jolly good show, jolly good show. I'm finally downtown. I'm almost by the coffee place. So, you know, I had to update y'all a little bit. So, yeah. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so this is the piercing place I was going to. So they open at one. If y'all see that, they open at one. So we'll be back here later. I do YouTube. Do you mind if I record? I do YouTube. Do you mind if I record? Okay. Do you want to get involved? <laughs> get me out your video, nigger. <laughs> Okay, hit. 
I do hear that. Should I go by like today? Because mm, that place opens open to a while. This place closes at like 2 or sometime soon. I think I'm gonna stay here. So, so far, guys, I spent $10 today. That piercing on a, is gonna be about 40 And I usually tip because I don't want to get broke. Let me know, comment down below. Do y'all tip? If y'all get a piercing from somewhere? Or like, do y'all just pay for it? It tastes more like blueberry and stuff. Orange too. Well, no, it tastes like an orange starburst. But like, a little kind of creamy. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I'm gonna be back in here. I'm gonna pick this camera back up. Shut up, straight to the penthouse, Miami Beach. Yo, talk crazy on tweets. I know she was probably looking like, why the f? You finna get in my vlog. You finna get on this, you know, this little TV. I didn't even get her a chance to respond, but it's like, oh well, if I go to jail, I go to jail. Like, y'all, so this is gelatos. I don't know if y'all probably seen me here before in the vlogs, but. <sighs> so this is where I have all the bulb or whatever. So the flavors are good, y'all. I ain't never saw those in there, so that's new. That bubble gum look good. It's look good. I don't like peanut butter, so like, that look nasty. That look good. It's look good. I kind of messed with chocolate milk. Let me see, I'm good. Mango, okay. Blue drum rancher, okay. Uh, I would eat this and I would try one today, but you know, I'm not trying to be <laughs> shit, so. And I think I'm a little terrible. So this is the upstairs, y'all. We're gonna be right here, so y'all can get a clear vision of me. There's a palm colored man down there. He's staring at me all the time, but like, I don't care. What's up? It's my bad, you know. Rules are the time. These are my voodoo ones that I'm gonna be working with today. And I'm just gonna do a little reading on myself, see what's going on in my life. We're probably gonna stay here till one, and then we're gonna get the piercing, and then we're gonna go by the lake, and then we're gonna go home. Y'all know the schedule. If you made it this far, leave a like. Don't be a weirdo. I forgot to bring my black tourmaline piece. I usually bring that just, you know, so there's no negativity and stuff. But recently I've been using it at home, like rubbing it on my body and stuff like that. And like, you know, trying to cleanse my energy. The way these tarot cards hold in this box, it's a, it's slide open like that. They don't want it cause I come to defeat. They don't want it. I think they need a thousand feet. We run blue sticks out on the Jeep. It's a new weirdo every week. Weirdo. Get the work, put it up for my seeds. No care for the IG. This no care. You're in the thing for club. You're in the thing. You're in the thing for club. You're in the thing. Okay, guys. So I just got done reading and stuff. And doing a tale reading. I was reading up on this uh, famous tale reader. Well, she was like a fortune teller and a dream seer. So her name was Chloe Russell and basically at nine she was taken away by these slave masters and stuff and abused and stuff and she was about to kill herself like almost two times and then her dad came to her in her dreams and told her like not to kill herself and stuff like that and then the second dream she was gifted you know with abilities to tell the future and stuff and people say that she predicted like the revolutionary war and stuff like that plantation owner basically i reached out to her she could use her gifts for him and find where this money was lost from the dude's dad or whatever he hit like sixty thousand dollars away and it was found in his house and then when he found it he bought her freedom for her she i guess bought her own house whatever and then she also freed some of the slaves with the money he paid her like five hundred dollars she bought her own house, free some slaves and stuff. I don't know how she died and maybe she just died of old age after that. But it was it was deep. It went deep. Also in the article it also explained like it was another person that was doing the same thing and it was some stuff that wasn't true and stuff like because she wrote a book about this too. This too. What's going on? Yeah, so after that, she wrote a book of that and people were saying like, oh, this is not true and this is not true because they don't know what is true because like they don't know what, what was true of her story beyond the book. They just took part of stories passed down and copied and you know so but yeah it was a very interesting article but i need to um because that smoothie and that coffee is really coming through it's like i'm getting the urge and i'm not getting the urge so it's just like i don't know what's gonna happen but i think i'm fine at the moment i'm gonna be down here till one you know piercing and stuff like i said and then go to the lake but i don't know we'll see what happens y'all but hey guys my friend today is here so yeah i'm gonna get my piercing at one i'm really i'm really glad you came too so now i don't have to be there around myself what are you getting pierced my industrial oh, i want to get it on this ear 
No, because some people I'll be in a mixed motion. It'll be better than my damn septum. That shit was appears crooked. Bro. And everything. Nah, cause Y'all wanna see my broken ass window? Since motherfuckers wanna be fucking messy and throw <laughs> bricks in my fucking window. There's a whole ass brick. I don't know where the fuck it is. <laughs> it's back there. I'm gonna catch y'all up later, y'all. Bye. So guys, I'm gonna get my piercing today. I'm scared, y'all. I'm scared. I need to fix my jewelry. I do YouTube. Do you mind if I report? Sure. I'm, I'm okay. Sure. I'm just vlogging. Yeah, that's cool. Okay. I didn't get this year. Yeah. And I got. You want any more? <laughs> How much would it be for both of them? For um, okay, that's not bad. It's pretty in here, bro. Okay. So you know, yeah, on the right side. Yeah, my yeah, my right. Uh, I look so tired. That's because I am. And then for the flat, do you want to do a crystal or steel? Um, a crystal. Okay. Three hours later. How are we feeling? Uh, scared, but I got my crystals on me and I'm just getting through because I know it's going to look good. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pierce the first hole, I'll put the jewelry in, pierce the second hole, put the jewelry the rest of the way through. Okay, so I'm going to have you turn your head to the left a little. Okay. I just want to start taking some nice big deep breaths here. <laughs> Even hurt that bad. That's just a jewelry. That wasn't even what? That was the second one gonna feel like that too? Second one you feel a little bit more, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. <laughs> okay. Nice big deep breaths here. Ooh. Ooh. Ah! Yeah! Ooh. That one sounded like I hurt you a little more. Yeah. Test me the ball off. Her. On a pussy hole. <laughs> Not too bad? No. I thought it was going to put like a sword on in there. Like. <laughs> you did really good. Thank Most you. People, like with the second one are like, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you did really good. Needles or anything? Yeah, okay. I believe so. Okay. Moments. And this one got pierced from this girl that I met on a dating app. And she pierced my titty. Um, <laughs> and like, I, I hear that like leaks out like weird shit. Like first time was like, yeah, that sounds awful. So like, the thing that was biting them was a fucking mouth full of bacteria. And then this one you want it right in the middle? Yeah. Should we it real quick? And maybe it also feels different too, because like it's not in my nose when my septum's like, oh my god. Yeah. You know what's funny? You don't smoke because you look high as fuck. I'm dead. When they smoke pot around me spiritually, I can't feel anybody's energy around me no more. What? Yeah. It's, it's like so weird. That's weird. Yeah. Or some ops. I feel like they did that on purpose, but. Those hurt a little bit. I like how it's in the center. It's not just like some basic bitch like top of the. Nah, because my energy has been like great, bull, confident today. I love that. And I love the way that I recorded Impulsive. this video so I far. I encouraged your impulsion. Yeah. I think you were like the great energy around me today to go through this. Oh, thank you. Is that toxic to text your ex happy birthday? Depends on the ex. Brr. Two and one. Brr. It's giving me, you know, McDonald's deal. See, if we do like a video where we're like going in a tunnel and like I take my t like titties out just to like be ironic, like that's. <laughs> okay. okay. So this one fell off. And there's. I'm gonna take that. I have to out. take it all the way off. I would, or what you could do is at least try taking the weight off of it. Oh, like, yeah. Like, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know your titties were that big. Yeah, I'm going to go with it. Yeah, I'm going to go with it. So we are coming.
you with a force Yeah, that's the day I keep on rejoicing on Got me some apple fritters from this bakery As y'all see it What's it called? Main, Main Street? Yeah, all that Apple fritter Y'all see it in the bag? Yeah yeah, so I'm gonna close out the vlog now. That was the end of everything. If you guys made it this far in the video, and if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe, turn post notifications on, because I'll be back for another banger, like I said. We got an industrial today, this pierce today. We got donuts, and we went and tried a coffee place. So, yeah, I'm gonna do the recap, and bye, y'all. I love y'all. Bye. Guys, I'm in McDonald's getting a water and a lemon fry, because I need to get my water in today. I only got the fry because it was like, 60 cents for the water, so like I might as well add a dollar and give me a water to mine. And if you got the main auto set, you know.